Hey guys, what is up? Alex Scott here with Concertini.com. Thank you so much for checking out another one of our super cool studio gear reviews. Today we're taking a look at a fabulous microphone. This is the Audio-Technica AT4050. This one in particular is the CM5 variant, which is a little bit older, but the 4050 is still in production and uh, they've all pretty much been designed the same with some few very minor differences in terms of features. So this mic is incredibly versatile. It's got a very modern, detailed kind of a sound to it, which I personally am not a huge fan of in my own personal mic selection. This one actually belongs to my dad. He uses it in his recording studio all the time and gets great results out of it. I tend to like a little bit more characterful mics, but if you like a really modern, kind of a sheeny sound, this mic is gonna be an awesome fit for that. In terms of features, we have three different polar patterns. We can do Omni, we can do Cardioid, or we can do Figure 8 selectable right here on the front of the mic. And then flipping around to the back, we do have a low cut, and we also have a 10 dB pad for when we need to record louder sources. So we've got a really great all-around feature set. It is a large diaphragm mic. It does require phantom power. But yeah, kind of the hallmark of this mic to me and a lot of Audio-Technica's mics is just a very modern sound. It's got a really present, detailed top end, um, a bit more kind of rolled off in the, in the lower spectrum, which is going to be great for sources like modern vocals. So if you're doing pop or R&B or hip hop rap vocals, that kind of stuff um, or if you're doing like real modern rock maybe guitars or drums anything like that this mic is going to be a really excellent choice because it, it has that really modern vibe to it so what we're going to go ahead and do is head out to the tracking room I'll get this set up over some drums in front of an acoustic guitar and I'll do some voiceover so you guys can hear kind of what the mic sounds like get an idea of the vibe and hopefully that will give you guys a good idea of as to whether or not it is something you'd be interested in so let's set up the camera out there and check it out. Okay guys, so here we've got our Audio-Technica AT4050 set up directly over the center of the kit. We're about three and a half feet up from the snare. So let's go ahead and check out how it sounds. Okay guys, we've got our Audio-Technica AT4050 set up as an acoustic mic now, um, six inches off the 12th fret, pretty standard, and I am in open D tuning, which is kind of cool, so let's check out how it sounds. Okay guys, so now we have the AT4050 set up as a pretty typical voiceover mic. Um, so just talking a bit for a moment so you guys can hear its tone on my voice as compared to the shotgun mic we were using in the video earlier. That was a dynamic mic. Obviously this is a condenser and a very modern sounding condenser at that. So you're definitely gonna hear a lot more presence in the top end. You're gonna hear a lot more detail. You're gonna hear a lot more robustness and sort of a forward sound to the whole thing overall. So. There you go. Okay guys, so there you go. Audio-Technica AT4050. Such a detailed, modern, bright, uh, forward sounding mic. And it, it, again, just because I don't like that does not mean it's a bad mic. It's an incredible sounding mic if that's the tone you're after. I tend to like old kind of Neumann, you know, German stuff, Telefunkens, that kind of a thing, U87s, U47s, that have a bit more of a vintage vibe to them. They they aren't as detailed and as present and as, as forward and kind of aggressive as a mic like this is. But that is totally a thing of personal preference. If you're doing really modern music styles, this is going to be an excellent mic for you guys to look at picking up. Um, it is not the cheapest mic in the world. It does retail for right around 700 
$100, which, you know, you could definitely get some cheaper mics. You could also get a lot more expensive mics, but I think that's a perfectly fair price point. It's really well built, really rugged, comes with a good shock mount. And, you know, yeah, again, that's just the point that I really want to drive home here is, is just how modern it sounds, how, how current it sounds. So if that's the kind of tone that you're after, this is going to be a great bet. But what do you guys think of Audio-Technica's mics? Have you used the 4050 or this CM5 variant in particular? Do you like their mics in general? Do you not? Do you like this kind of modern, sheeny, top-end thing? Whatever you guys may think, I'd love to hear what you have to say in the comments down below, so definitely head down there. Again, my name is Alex Scott with ConcertDini.com. Thank you guys so much for checking out the video. Be sure to smash that subscribe button, nail that like button, and gently tap the notification bell to be notified when we upload new videos. As always, we'll see you in the next video.